We're under attack. The new world order isn't an empire that just attacks countries. It attacks the individual. It attacks language. It attacks speech. It attacks intelligence. Because it is an extermination system. It is a full spectrum dominance death machine unleashed. And we're only in the middle phases of its unfolding system of total grid control. When the grid is completed and we're approaching that point, then the rollout exterminations will begin through controlled bioweapon releases that will be blamed on accidents, but also on terrorists. The tens of thousands that die in the first waves will be used as martyrs to set up highly controlled biocontainment grids over cities, integrated with the carbon tax control grids as another overlay uh, pretext for total surveillance. Then, a few years after those grids have been put in, mass plagues will hit, killing hundreds of millions. Then even greater controls will be put in place. Then the super mega death. They intend to release a bioweapon and probably only keep five, ten thousand people alive. They tell their minions and acolytes that that twenty percent will be left alive. That's in the official UN Biological Diversity Assessment, 1996, Club of Rome statements. You hear the Ted Turner statements, the Jacques Cousteau statements, uh, because the government minions and bureaucrats and power tripping computer company owners, you know, they think they're going to be on the inside. So they say. Uh, you know, for the outer masses that are into the control freak religion of talking about killing the unwashed masses, they say 80% kill. But when you get into actual academic circles, they say 95%, and that's it. Peter Singer uh, at, at Princeton, Dr. Pianca, UT, every university, they run all the major departments. They always publish books, Rockefeller Foundation or UN saying we need global police state to carry out the extermination and then the true acolytes say I am not worthy I am a, 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 a professor Dr. Pianca I am ready to die with my family soon the airborne Ebola will be among us and then his graduate students send me threatening letters and I google their name and it's them in white lab coats in US government bioweapons facilities hardcore savage death machines ready to kill you and your family and they can't wait and they think you're too weak to understand their attack profile i've given it all to you ladies and gentlemen listen to me police officers military all of you they're gonna murder all of us dead or to the hammer you better come in and join the republic for the big win and we need to deal with these people immediately and build the, the bases and go off world and there can be a trillion humans we don't have to act like this and let a bunch of degenerate scum run our lives i've had it Wake up! I demand you break your conditioning! Because when you get into their higher level literature, they say humans are a parasite, period, and they're going to kill everybody except for the chosen few that merge with machines.